So it's my favourite part of the show now when you get to do all the work. And the question today is, how has being an APA member shaped your career? It's almost every year I've been a member, I've come to the APA meeting, wherever it may be, and it enables me to keep up with the newest information, the newest medications. Uh, it's provided continuing education without fail. Get oriented with what's going on in the rest of the psychiatric world. Um, somehow you're able to keep up to date with stuff. It helps you also with CME credits once you graduate. Also lots of uh, publications that um, is available in the bookstore, the APA bookstore. You can access them. There are lots of resources, materials that can enable you to enrich and garnish your career. And also the meetings that we come to annually is a good place to network with other people and um, touch base with friends around the world, see what's going on there and how you can um, go back and sort of tweak what you're doing and, um, you know, um, get more efficient. Okay, I'm an academic psychiatrist. I'm working in academic position in, as an assistant professor in psychiatry and sleep medicine. I'm also specialized. So it's like there are, if anything new, uh, any new advances or any new me medication or anything new come out, I usually go to APA website and look for that if anything, uh, uh, if I, any difficult patient I see in my clinic and then I will go and look for is there anything new available to treat this patient, make how I can help this patient out if any new advances or any new medication that I can try for that patient. And also I'm looking for jobs, so I go to APA Job Central and look for job opportunities. So there are a lot of advantages for being an APA member. I usually go to, went to, to APA annual meetings. It's very important to be uh, updated in the field of psychiatry. Well, I'm from Canada, but uh, being a member of the APA, uh, I guess, gives me you know, some, I guess, access to resources like the uh, APA Journal comes to my door uh, every month, and you know, I certainly read the highlights of that, and you know, discounts uh, on things like the DSM-5, which I just bought, and discounts on the conference, and being aware of the conferences, and uh, certainly it's an opportunity to learn about uh, updates and. Uh, new developments so uh, you know it, it's been a useful thing for me and that's why I've maintained my membership uh, through the years. Well, well for first of all you know uh, with the APA you know you do, do get the green journal you know and there's a lot of very good uh, uh, scientific information in that plus you know uh, the meeting is I think is a very valuable experience uh, plus you know all the resources you know uh, which come with the APA and I, and I know we should be helping APA anyway because APA does a lot of good work. Now don't worry, if we didn't get to you today, you can still join in on Twitter using the hashtag APAAM13.